Hey guys, I'm Javan Wade. He's been in EastEnders, Doctor Who, and now he's a Hollywood actor. And it all started right here on this wall in Lucian. OK, now more of what, what you just saw. He's only 24 years old, but he's an online comedy star and gets 200 million views every single month. It all started for Jovan Waite sitting on a wall in South London. He's now broken into Hollywood and he spoke to Wendy Hurrell about his rapid success. But instead of sending Wendy all the way to Hollywood, we got him to meet her on that wall. It's so much cheaper. Every Hollywood actor's career has to start somewhere. And for Jovan Wade, it was this wall in Broccoli. A group of friends on a wall in South London was something in which was yeah, easy for us to, to get into grips with. He co-created Mandem on the Wall while studying at the Brit School, a comedy take on life experiences for young people in London. All London was kicked down a bin way. Yeah, <laughs> Ten episodes later, 40 million views, the professional roles were on the way. My view has always been, OK, if I don't get that role, then I'll create my own and I'll create as many shows as I want. And, you know, to get to my dream of being in Hollywood, if I'm not going to be cast in a film, then I'll make one, you know, and that's always been been the mentality. Go do your thing, sis. Always. I'll see you tonight. But he is now in a Hollywood film. The first Purge came out yesterday. On set, Jovan didn't let on he was a Londoner, talking in an American accent right up until filming wrapped. And then going into, oh, lovely to meet you. Thanks so much for the shoe, blah, blah, blah. And people were like, who are you? That's, a, that's an amazing English accent. Like, how did you how do you do that? I was like, no, I'm, I'm British. I just kind of held it together this whole time. And they didn't like, know. They didn't know. But he'd like not to always travel to LA for these roles, wants to see more diversity in the UK. It's an emergency, trust me. Like that of Riggsy in Doctor Who. It was the first big BBC show that I, I managed to do, and it was a different character as well. When I'm talking about, you know, playing these characters that are not hoodie number one, two and three, that was a great opportunity for me to be able to play a character in which wasn't in this box in which a lot of us are put in. And so, yeah, utterly grateful for that. I don't know when it was sinking. As you can see, I'm just like, yo, this is a dream come true and I'm just so grateful. Wendy Hurrell, BBC London News.